hello guys welcome to our today's tutorial and in today's tutorial i'll be teaching you how to make door translations using css and html it's really simple and elegant and it will surely enhance the user interface of your site you can even use it to hide the elements or in even the menu bars so let me remove the css code and we'll html and css code and we'll be begin it's really short and sweet it's contained it has only 24 line of CSS codes to work on so now we have a clear canvas to work with let's begin first of all we'll be creating a simple div element with class door and our HTML markup is complete now now our HTML is complete so moving towards the CSS first of all we'll be setting perspective to the body element because perspective property is really important over here because we are gonna render it in 3d and so it will give a better effect but make sure to remember perspective property applies on the child elements not on the element itself so now let's style the door we'll be setting height and width to 100 percent because that will be covering a whole gray whole area you can change them later on but it's up to you how big you want them and how small you want them float it's optional but I prefer it and background to something but up here we are using the purple and as you can see it's done it's a clear whole screen square now what we'll be adding is a simple animation sorry transition edit so door hash hover will be just setting a transition sorry transform rotate y to 45 degrees 45 degrees for this screen it may vary from uh, screen sizes so you better be careful you should use media career if you want to make it responsive responsive so now check out it look okay it's looking like a door now let's add some transition transition 1s okay it will make it consistent throughout okay now it's really awesome looking now now what we'll be doing is trying with different things like if you turn from rotate x to rotate y it will become vertical one see it's much like a track path or you can even enter the values in minus so it will go it will become reverse and uh, even the same thing you can do with rotate y when you can just change them to negative values rotate y minus 45 degree it will go to the right side as you can see it's really nice pretty and you fluid is optional i told you but you better take it and i hope you liked my tutorial please subscribe me and share it please subscribe me more things are on the way this week i'll be providing you really decent videos thanks for watching once again